Hi guys, so this is our fifth sum on trigonometric identities. So the question over here is prove that 1 upon cosec theta minus cot theta minus 1 upon sin theta is equals to 1 upon sin theta minus 1 upon cosec theta plus cot theta. So in this kind of sum, rather than proving this part, I'll change my proof a little bit. I'll change my question a little bit. Rather than proving for 1 upon cosec theta minus cot theta minus 1 upon sin theta, I'll prove for 1 upon cosec theta minus cot theta plus 1 upon cosec theta plus cot theta. This should be equal to 2 sin theta. How did I do this? I took minus 1 upon cosec theta plus cot theta part on my LHS and I took 1 upon sin theta negative to the RHS. So it becomes 2 upon sin theta in the RHS and it becomes 1 upon cosec theta minus cos cot theta plus 1 upon cosec theta plus cot theta in the LHS. So rather than proving the given part, I'll prove this. So let's start with LHS. First of all, I need to convert cosec and cot to sin and cos because my RHS is in sin theta. 1 upon 1 upon sin theta minus cos theta upon sin theta plus 1 upon 1 upon sin theta plus cos theta upon sin theta sin theta is common so we'll take take it in the numerator sin theta upon 1 minus cos theta plus 1 upon over here also sin theta 1 plus cos theta okay so I'm having the same numerator right now but are my denominator same no so I have to cross multiply or what I can do is I can take sin theta common then what I'm left with is 1 minus cos theta plus 1 upon 1 plus cos theta in this particular part I can multiply, I can cross multiply. So 1 plus cos theta plus 1 minus cos theta. I just cross multiplied. Divided by 1 minus cos theta and 1 plus cos theta will be multiplied over here and that becomes 1 minus cos square theta. Minus cos theta plus cos theta got cancelled. So what are we left with? We are left with sine theta. 1 plus 1, 2, that is multiplied by 2, divided by 1 minus cos square theta. But 1 minus cos square theta can be written as sine square theta. Okay, so sine theta and square is cancelled. So I am left with 2 upon sine theta. And this is what I required in my RHS. So I have proved LHS equals to RHS. Hence, proved thank you so much for watching this video make sure you like share and subscribe also tell your friends to subscribe to my channel thanks a lot i'll be updating more stuff about hsc jen cbse exams and nios exams as well so make sure you are tuned to my channel thanks thanks a lot